Mid Journey has done it again. They've released an early version of their model personalization. Your AI image generations becoming more personal to your own style and liking. Up until now, every time you wrote a prompt, it was subject to Mid Journey default settings, which means it was heavily influenced by their own algorithm. And what would happen is that their algorithm would usually fill in the blanks of your unspoken part of the prompt with preferences, which are combinations of preferences of their community and biases. And watching changes the game is the model personalization which can learn what you like and any images you generate using this feature will be tailor-made meaning the missing blanks of your unspoken part of your prompt will be filled in with your own taste and style preferences these sets of images were generated using the same prompt the first law was generated using the me journey default style and the second law was generated using my own personal style between the two of them i actually preferred the images that were generated using my own personal style and if you want to generate some images using my own personal style the code will be on a description section down below and just to show you how everyone's style is so personal to them these sets of images again they were generated using the same prompt but the only difference is like each image was generated using a separate personal style code the first law i used a guy called nick i used the code that he shared on his ex account and if you want to check out nick i'll leave the link to his account he's amazing he does some amazing work when it comes to me journey looking at these two sets of images it's amazing how different they are but yet they were generated using the same prompt it's amazing how the me journey board can actually distinguish everyone's taste for me i actually like the images that my personal code generates if you're wondering how the me journey board will learn your taste it does this when you vote in the in pair ranking or any of the images that you like on the explore page to rank images go to the me journey website Site. and on this section where you can see the menu click on task which is right at the bottom it should bring you to this page click on rank images and once you do that it will bring you to this page here where you can see two images and all you have to do from here is choose the one you like once you click on the one that you like it will bring you the next lot of images that you can pair again and the next lot and the next lot and you can rank as many images as you want and another way that the mid journey board can know what you like is through the explore page all you have to do is click on explore and like any of the images you see in order for this feature to work for you you need to have roughly 200 votes on the pair and ranking or likes on the explore page to find how many images that you've ranked type in slash info and then enter and this box will appear on your screen and from here you'll be able to see this ranking count here if you're using the web version of me journey you can find the ranking count on the pair and ranking page right here and that's that to use personalization mode on your prompt simply enter dash dash p at the end of the prompt and once your prompt is running on me journey a special code will be added onto that prompt which is what will give your images their personal taste and you can use this code on any of your images or you can simply just do the dash dash p every time you do the prompt same difference if you don't want to keep adding the dash dash p on all your prompts you also have the option to turn this on or off on your settings options if you're using discord all you have to do is type in slash setting and this box will appear and here you'll find the personalization button if it's green that means the mode is active if it's not it's off and if you're using the web version of me journey all you have to do is click on adjust your prompt setting and this box will appear on the model section you'll have the on and off button and that's that when it comes to that another thing you can do is control the strength of the personalization effects on your images using the stylization parameter dash dash s the value for this ranges between zero to a thousand with zero meaning that it's off with a hundred being the default value that mid journey is using and a thousand being the maximum value all right i know this can sound a bit complicated but i'll, I'll explain more these sets of images were generated using the prompt that you can see down below. The generation for these images relied solely on the Mid Journey general algorithm. Again, the same prompt was used for these images. For the second lot of images, I used my personalization style, the dash dash p, which gave me the code above the images. The default personalization strength effect was used, which is the dash dash 100. So these images are supposed to reflect a moderate level of my personalization style and liking. According 
according to me journey and here if i lower the personalization strength effect to dash dash zero meaning that it's off as you can see from this the first sets of images the outputs are more generic and they don't look like they're influenced by my own personal style even though i use the dash dash p if i do the opposite of this and increase the personalization effect to the maximum which is dash dash s 1000 and as you can see from these images i would say they're heavily influenced by my own personal style and if i had to choose between the two sets of images i actually prefer the ones with the highest personalization effect and i hope that makes sense it's also important to know that this feature is not stable yet it's subject to change as you like more images as you ray more images and as me journey continue to update the, the system also if you want to share your code with other people so that they can test out your style on their prompts you can do that and at the same time you can test out other people's codes and stuff like this all right guys so that's that for me for this video i hope this video will be helpful to you if you like this video please don't forget to give me a like don't forget to subscribe for some more videos like this my name is abigail and i'll see you next time thank you for watching bye bye so